I'll show you how to document DRC errors in HTML report in this video. My name is Sandy Peng and I'm the TNE for Calibre Interfaces. Let's look at this case. When I'm running DRC for my design and I have an error that I want to send it to Foundry for a possible waiver, and I don't want to share my entire design with the Foundry yet. So I have to send Foundry a report which captures the error information and its surrounding. I have to open the design, take screenshots, and do lots of copy and paste for the report. Even worse, I might have to do this for dozens of errors. It will take me hours to finish it, and I want to avoid this if it's possible. Calibre has a solution to this, and it can automate this entire process using one simple command line. For example, I have this error that I want to ask Foundry for a possible waiver. First, I mark it as waived. Then I enter the wait comment as need to negotiate with Foundry for a possible waiver. I also mark the next 10 errors as waived but with no wait comments. When I select the waivers in RV window, RV saves those information in DRC Giselle database .wait file in the directory. Now let's look at what the report looks like. I'll go into a detail about this command line in a minute. This command line will generate the report in HTML format, and you can use Firefox to open the report afterwards. In the report, under the Big Caliber header, there's a hyperlink that can take me to the wave result that I'm interested. On the left hand side of the result is a snapshot of the waiver, and if you put your mouse cursor on it, it will pop up a window that has more detailed information about the waiver. In the middle, there's a layer palette and the word view for your waiver. On the right hand side is a result table. It contains more detailed information about your waiver, such as checks and what cell is it in. It also has a wave comment I just put in the, in the RVE section. And it will be same format for all my 11 waivers. I've shown you what the report looks like. Now let's learn how to generate the report from scratch together. The command I used earlier is as following. Caliber-rve-drc-input spec file. Spec file is a list of past information to your files, such as layout files and your DRC result file. Dash report. Report in file is a report configuration file that determines what information and the format you want on the report. Dash outputter is a path to your output directory. User has to create spec file and report in the file themselves. Let's start with the spec file format. Spec file is a text file and it contains a list of your input file information. The first file is a DRC result database file, followed by an optional RDB file type, then followed by the path to your layout file, then an optional layer property file. Then the last section is your layout file format. The report configuration file is rather more complex. You can get the detailed information in Calibre Interactive and RV Users Manual. Inside the manual, we also have a generic configuration file for you. This generic configuration file is at Chapter 9 DRC HTML Reporting under the section Example for DRC HTML Reporting. You may copy the generic file in the end of the section. This generic configuration file can take snapshot of the waiver and it can generate the result table, just like what I showed you earlier in this video. Today, I showed you how to use Calibre to document the waived results in HTML format. Calibre can also help you to generate the histogram and density map in the report based on your need. Thank you for watching this video, I hope this is helpful.